I wanted to talk about the 61st Ohio here at Gettysburg, um, but it is so cold and so windy outside the car at the moment. What is it? About three in the afternoon on January the 25th. It's so cold and so windy outside the car that I lose my hat and all that you'll hear on the microphone is the buffeting of the wind. So I've retreated inside the car where it's warm and there is no wind. And I guess we'll have to save talking about um, McGroity and the 61st Ohio and their picket line out here and their uh, fight in support of Dilger's battery as the infantry support for that battery and uh, we'll have to talk about all that another day because it's just too cold and um, as we say cold enough to freeze the balls off a brass monkey and I don't want to put that to the test so we'll talk about that another day one of the hazards I guess of battlefield touring during the winter uh, trying to film content trying to do battlefield uh, curriculum building during the during the winter is that first of all you get snow on the ground um, Battle of Gettysburg took place in July not in January and second of all it is often cold and often windy um, people complain here during the summer that it's hot and humid as heck and it is hot and humid as heck and that's the conditions that they fought the battle in um, but it is cold and windy in this part of Pennsylvania during the winter and today is no exception so just one of the hazards of uh, trying to get out here and film this content for you anyway thanks for bearing with me and this video which was turned out to be a video about nothing um, could have talked about Lieutenant Colonel McGrady um, taking over command of the regiment in 61 uh, after the previous commander uh, Schleilich had been accused of cowardice and faced a court martial 61? 62? 62 probably and uh, he'd resigned before facing a court martial McGrady had taken over commanded the battalion well, sorry commanded the regiment for the rest of the war um, fighting Irishman had been shot through the lung in 61 survived that came back to this regiment commanded this regiment and uh, put up a good fight here at Gettysburg uh, despite the odds uh, despite being in a bad position here covered by um, enemy artillery and uh, superior infantry forces uh, put up a reasonable fight before pulling back through the town but I guess we're not gonna do a video about that today because it's too cold to get out of the car <laughs>